Let's talk health now. To close the gap of shortages for nurses and midwives by the year 2030, about 70,000 frontline workers will be needed. However, experts at this year's International Day of Nurses say the estimates are not looking good. Health correspondent Kemi Balogun has more. As the world gradually returns to normalcy post-COVID, frontline healthcare workers like nurses will continue to play critical roles in future health challenges that may arise. This year's theme, Our Nurses, Our Future, highlights the need for health system strengthening for the future. This gathering wants a lot more done to encourage the nursing and midwife profession through investments in nursing education and improvement in service delivery. It is unfortunate that in Nigeria the nurses are suffering a lot because of non-recognition of their key rules, which is indispensable. Nurses all around the world need to address the global health challenges and improve global health for her by the moving nurses from by moving nurses from invisible to invaluable in the eyes of the policy makers. Brain drain continues to play a key role in the shortages of these specialized frontline health workers due to several factors. The 2021 State of the World's Midwifery Report puts the shortages of midwives in Nigeria at about 30,000, which is 6 per 10,000 people. To close this gap, about 70,000 nurses and midwives will be needed by the year 2030, but with current estimates, only about 40,000 will be available. There must be availability of right quantity of nursing personnel existing at all levels of care with appropriate bent of experience, skills, and training to meet the client's needs. And the condition of service and environment must motivate uh, the staff to promote excellent care. As I speak, over 75,000 nurses have left Nigeria in the last five years. As a result of poor conditions of service here in Nigeria, poor wages, and of course, people move about to other areas they are recognized. Experts here believe that the lessons learned from the pandemic need to be translated into actions for the future in order to ensure that nurses are protected and valued for the future. Kemi Balugun, TVC News, Abuja.